bargaining agreement is that we we wanted to not so much focus on a salary cap, we wanted to focus on a salary spend. Mm -hmm. So every team has an obligation over a four-year rolling tranche to spend 89% of the salary cap over that four-year uh, time in cash, not likely to be earned incentives, not or bonuses, not paid, none of that. Sure. So the, the last two teams that are below the 89% spend are the Raiders uh, and Jacksonville. What that means is that if you take the salary cap of next year, mm -hmm. they will have to overspend on the salary cap next year in order to be in compliance with uh, that 89%. Have the Raiders been out of compliance before? Is this new? So that this is the, fir this is the, the first, first, was the first right. year. So this is the first, these are the first four years of the new requirement. The reason why Raider fans are interested is that Mr. Davis has tried to sell a percentage of the team. However, that percentage he's trying to sell is not going to stay in construction. So we're starting to put together a, what looks like a picture of a team that, and I'm not asking you to say this, but it looks like they have some money spending issues. Well, and I, I don't know, but right. but um, and the only thing I care about, uh, yeah, not really true, but one significant thing I care about is the money that they spend on our players and their obligations to to perform according to the contract that we have. Thank you. Thank you, sir.